70 million smart meters, 800,000 connected products. They're all Siemens products sitting in factories today. And we can connect to those immediately. That's what Mind Connect is all about. We'll connect to other devices as well, but we already built it. We can connect to all of those right away and have the feedback loop back. Mindster then is the, the operating system on the top of the applications that sit on top. Application example, you hear a little bit about, um, I think during the presentation or the week, Omnio. You haven't heard about it before. Omnio, for example, Dell, Peter uses Omnio, our solution today, for analyzing supply chain information. They were able to analyze 9 billion pieces of information, 9 billion pieces of information in three hours to fix a production problem that they had in the product. Previously, it would have taken them three weeks to do that, using Omnio, our solution set. Now, the interesting thing about that is Omnio is an app, in the case of Dell, that was prior to us having MindSphere as the IoT platform in place, so they built their own. But that's the point about being open. Our apps will run on platforms that are not always ours, and our platform is going to support apps that aren't always ours. It's an open solution to be able to build against. The advantage, again, is that Siemens has immediate connectivity to all of that stuff sitting in the factory today. An example of this is a um, customer you have in Germany, but they're using this for um, uh, analytics. Really, it's about you know, condition monitoring, preventive maintenance, the classic things you would think about in an IoT strategy of, of looking at a factory, or looking at a machine tool. But it seems as we think about, we could do a little bit more. And that is, we say your MindSphere lets you speak sneaker. What we're saying is sneakers, golf clubs, machines, all the sensors in them. How do we take that information again, as I said before, feed it back and make changes to the product? We thought the golf club was gonna act this way. Out of the 500,000 we sold, the sensors are telling us, no, it's not acting the way we how do we change that, bring it back? That machine tool I showed you before, let's suppose you've got 10,000 of those machine tools installed around the world, and you've got a failure happening, and the failure's happening because of a vibration problem. Well, instead of us just coming back and telling you you've got a vibration problem through IoT, we're gonna take the sensor data, actual vibration data, feed it into our 1D analytics tools and 3D analytics tools, and actually run iterations against the real vibration data that's happening in the field. A true feedback loop back. All right, so again, the idea of understand what's happening, how do you bring it back? Why is that important? It's back to what I said a moment ago. The differentiation here is not only will I tell you about preventive maintenance with our solution set, I'm gonna work with the products you have as well. It's that idea of ideation, realization, utilization, and representing the product, the production, and what's happening in the field, and then holistically covering it through software, mechanical, electrical. That's what our story is. And there's no one, there's no one in the marketplace that can do this. It's our differentiation with what we're doing with MindSphere. A few other things. We talk a lot about uh, the product set, but I just want to talk about the things we're doing. When we talk about systems, for example, I've always said systems are very important, a systems design approach is very important, but not at the expense of best-in-class tools. We still have to have the best CAD tools, we still have to have the best data management tools and so forth in what we're doing. And we also have to continue to make them easier to use, easier to deploy, and easier to buy, purchase, and work with. And so we've offered a number of SaaS solutions, software as a service. You don't install it, you don't have to worry about monitoring, you don't have to measure whatever, we run it for you. You come in and use the software as a service. Omnio is one of those examples. Works software as a service. Polarium for application lifecycle management. Same thing. You don't want to install it? We'll take care of it. We run it as a, on the back end on our site. Cloud-based solution. Team Center Rapid Start. Same thing. Up and running. You don't have to worry about it. We take care of it for you. And then in our CA space, we've done this for a long time. Is what we do with, with our solvers. What do we do with some of our applications? Again, all based on SaaS solutions. The other that we continue to invest in is small and medium.